service, reliability and impeccable safety to guide your experience. Allow Ethiopian Airlines to carry you across its doorstep and into its heart. Ethiopian Airlines, the new spirit of Africa. My name is Razak Mouna Abugir. I'm from Boku in the Upper East Region of Ghana. I stay at Nima Mamoudi. Oh, my new family, actually, we are five. We are five boys, two girls. I got into judo through one of my friends. When I was at the age of nine years, they were practicing judo. They were, the guy was, yeah, was practicing judo when one day, I, I quite remember, he came back with our, this already for the form. So, I mean, they approached him and I spoke to him and he, he, he brought me. And I just, I just joined the arts and that's, that, that's what. It was very, very difficult to combine two, this, uh, two things, judo and it was very difficult. Because by then, I have to go to school. And before I leave to school, I have to, I mean, fetch water and fill the drums. By then, I have to do all those things. By then I will be tired and I have to move to school. So from school, when I come back home, I have to move to go to judo again. That's what. So it was very difficult. I stopped schooling because of judo. But by then, I, you know, I like I like judo and I don't want anything to attract my judo. By then, yeah, when I was at the age of nine years, that was then. So I, I I don't want anything to I mean to come across my judo. Oh. I've, I've, I've never regret, regretted stopping work, but I've regretted stopping school. But I've not regretted stopping work. But after now, I know the work. And I normally work, you know, like, same employees. I normally work, so after the work, I've never regretted. When we were there, the plant I had with my charmer is, I'm just going there for the gold medal. And I knew I'm going to get the gold, the hurt. Because by then, because my training, like, I was in shape. I was very, I was in shape. And I was training very hard by then. But later on, you know, when we got the first fight, I won my first fight. I lose my second fight, but I, 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 I just consider it as, you know, it's lack of experience. That's what I can say. When I moved down to Richard, you know, I fought one guy in Britain. So I was like, so the plan is me to go and get the good medal, and now I can now. Go for the good. Why, bro why not bronze? Let me go. Let me go uh, all out. So I just went all out, and I won the Britain guy. So after my last fight is with the Mozambique guy. That's my bronze medal. You know, anytime you, uh, I mean, anytime you are on, in, uh, on the arena, and you just mention your name. They just mention your name, Razak Momuni from Ghana. When you hear the name of Ghana, you know. It's going to boost you, no matter how you are. No matter how you are, it's going to boost you. I hope to be a world champion and to be an Olympian as well. And after all these things, I would like to be a, maybe a judo coach, that kind of thing, so that I can help. I mean, a lot of you know youth just to I mean to achieve their aim in judo. My plans for real Olympic is. I've, I've already started my my game plan. I've already started my personal training. See from Glasgow after the 2014 Commonwealth Games. I've already started my my uh, my training. And as I'm talking to you now, I can tell you I'm very fit and I'm very ready. The only thing I need is if only they can sponsor me just to qualify. I'm I'm ever ready. reliability and impeccable safety to guide your experience. Allow Ethiopian Airlines to carry you across its doorstep and into its heart. Ethiopian Airlines, the new spirit of Africa.